but I'm dedicated. I'm determined to patronize my own struggling folk. I got enough money now to eat wherever I want. Oh, I can go to fancy restaurants and eat a bunch of stuff I can't even pronounce. Got to point to it on the menu to keep from embarrassing myself. I can go to fancy restaurants where the waitresses walk up to the table and respect you. Ask, what would you like, sir? But that ain't where I choose to go. I go to the little old broke down, struggling family owned soul food restaurant where they treat you. That's where I go. Where they treat you like you ain't worth a damn. Like they really don't even want you in the damn place. Where the waitress just walk up to the table and stand there and look at you. You don't say nothing. You got about 30 seconds to order something she just walk off. You must not want a damn thing. You know what you brought yourself in for? That's where I choose to go. But I don't go being quiet. You don't get no us to trying to help nobody. I be raising, you know, I be raising hell when I hit the dope. You know things gonna be run backwards. Oxtails, 14 or $15 a plate. You can buy a whole damn ox for about $9.75. I be raising hell asking questions like, how come it ain't no screen? On the screen door. What about all these damn flies flying around in here? Should have brought me a fork, a knife, a spoon, and a fly swatter to kill some of these damn flies. Where the napkins at? Where the rest of the tablecloths at? What's all this sticky stuff on the damn table? How come my table won't be still? How come my chair wobbling? I got to balance myself up here. Eat this hard chicken. Why is the cook and the waitress putting the food on my plate with our hands? You got no utensils in this damn place? Why don't somebody sweep them cobwebs down off the wall? Where the rest of the ceiling tiles at? Where the light bulbs and the lampshades at? How come the ceiling fan ain't got no blades on it? Why don't you cut it off? It ain't cooling a damn thing. Just clicking, irritating my ass to death. What kind of bug is that over there? What kind of bug is that? What about the bug on the wall? Is he dead? Just sweep his dead ass down. He's alive while he's standing still looking at my table. Did he order something up in here? Was it for here or was that the go line on the wall? Is he at my table? Maybe I'm at his damn table. How come you got to cut through the kitchen to get to the bathroom? Where are you going through the kitchen? You see, the cook ain't got no net or nothing on her head. That's the dish rag wrapped around her sweaty neck. Her teeth sitting on the side of the pot. I know she ball hit it, but she got dandruff. It's falling over in the chicken grease. Then the other day, once I got to the bathroom and finished doing what I had to do, then I looked up and realized wasn't no toilet paper or nothing in the damn bathroom. I left my pants down round my ankles. Got up, walked back into the kitchen, snatched that dish rag off her neck, wiped myself and threw it back at her. 